Hey everybody and welcome back to Wobbly Life! So Flamingo and I are here again today and I thought we would continue unlocking all of the new costumes from the sewer update. So we've shown you how to get the Whimsical Elf, the Bard Outfit, the Pottery Armor, the Bunny Pajamas, and then in last episode, the Number One Fan Top. So that leaves us with two more outfits. The, um, the Sewer Monster Outfit and the Rocket Outfit. So we're going to start by driving over here to the subway and showing you guys how to unlock the Sewer Monster Outfit. And while I do that, let me take a moment to say thanks for watching, guys. Um, if you're enjoying Wobbly Life on the channel, please hit that like button to let us know. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so. We passed 10,000 subscribers over the weekend, so we are super excited. Geek Mom will be getting us a cake in, in honor of this achievement. And, and now we, we have to turn our attention to 100,000 subscribers. So do what you can to help us get there, guys. We really appreciate it. So as I said, this is the subway station by the hospital. The guy with the sheriff hat reading the book. Um, and with this particular wobbly brother here. So you're going to want to jump off the platform and head to your left. Heading down this part of the subway tunnel over here. And you will find there is a new uh, opening in the wall on your right. Just past these two red doors. Right up ahead here. There we go. Right in there. And there is this blocked off wooden pipe. So I'm going to put Flamingo down here for a second. And we're going to come out here. And right over here, you will find an axe, which you can use to chop through those wooden boards. All right. Oop. So we'll come over here and we will chop down the wood. Right, we don't need the axe, and I will grab Flamingo, and we will jump into the hole. Woohoo! Um, where, where'd Flamingo go? Um, really? Flamingo despawns if you come in here? Oh man, that that is very upsetting. Anyway, you, you come through here into a land of sewer monsters, little Louie clones. Look at these guys. And one of them, you may notice, has a birthday hat on. So we're going to come up to him and, and wish him a happy birthday. Hey, happy birthday, buddy. Blarb, wama, dub, dub. And little Sewer Monster Jr. here wants a birthday cake. And, and I can understand that. I mean, who doesn't want a birthday cake? So we're going to do that. We're going to get him a cake. So we're going to go through this pipe here, which drops you out right down here on the docks. You come out of, see that sewer pipe up there? Yep, that's the one that doesn't have water coming out of it. And now, now we have to go get a cake for little Sewer Monster Jr. And, um, I, I think, I don't think they sell cake at the, the gas station or convenience store or the grocery store. I think the only place you can buy cake is at the coffee shop. Let me know down in the comments if that's the case. I mean, since I'm here, I'm gonna check, but I'm pretty sure they don't. Yeah, they do not sell cake here. All right, we have to go to the coffee shop, which is at the mall. And I'm, you know, I'm still kind of upset about Flamingo despawning. So I'm not going to go back and get him because he'd just despawn again. So we're going to get the cake and we're going to bring it back to Sewer Monster Jr. All right, we've got our cake. And we are going back to that subway station. I mean, you can go in any of the subway stations and make your way there. That one by the hospital is just the closest. And you will need to grab the axe again because the wood planks respawn, blocking the entrance. All right, so we got our cake, and we can jump down the pipe again. I mean, the cake doesn't despawn, so why did the flamingo? That's what I want to know. Why is the cake better than flamingo? Well, I mean, cake is better than flamingo, but that's not the point. Flamingo should not despawn. Ever. 
All right, so let's bring the little guy his birthday cake. Here you go. Happy birthday, buddy. Blop blabo. Dum wubba bobo blarb. And you have unlocked the sewer monster outfit. And I was going to show it to you down here, but since I, I can't bring Flamingo down here, um, we're going to show it to you here with Louie. Because Louie loves flamingos. It's a, it's a little known fact that he is quite fond of flamingos. They're hugging! Oh, it's so cute! So, from here, we need to fly over to the jungle island to unlock the rocket costume. And we're going to land over here because there is a scientist working in the jungle that we need to talk to. Right outside the military base. Hello, sir! If I connect this part to the shiny bit... Yes? Yes? Huh? Oh, hello! Sorry, you startled me! Welcome to my little camp. I see you noticed my latest project. What do you think? It's impressive, isn't it? No, not really. I've been camping out here studying that rocket so I could build my own one. It can't be that hard. Um, I only need a few more parts to get it working. In fact, perhaps you can help me. I need the following bits. A fuse. There should be some at the Wobbly Power Plant. Uranium ore. You'll have to go to the mines for this one. A big piece of metal. A large bin from the city should do. And finally, a small heavy bit of metal. A set of barbells would be perfect. If you can get all that to me, then I'll make you something extra special as a reward. All right. Sounds easy enough. So, you know what I have to do. I have to go get Flamingo. Because it's just not right to start another quest without our Flamingo friend. Alright, so we have recovered Flamingo, and unfortunately a thunderstorm has, has rolled in. So I'm going to take this, um, this truck right here, and we are going to drive up to the power station to get the fuse. The first of the things we need. So we come in here and we go over to the elevator, right over to the left. And we take it upstairs and inside here where you unlock Sparky, there is a fuse. So we're gonna take this down and load it into the truck. All right, you, you'll keep an eye on this, right Flamingo? All right, oh, ow! Wow, that was close. All right. From here, we're going to drive down into the city by the bank. Because behind the bank, you will find a trash bin. And we'll open up the back of the truck and we will grab the trash bin and put it in the back with Flamingo and Fuse. All right, get it in here. All right. Come in. Oh, really? Lightning struck the truck? I tell you. All right. With all of this together, we're going to we're going to go drop this off before we get the other things because the trash bin and the barbells will not both fit in this truck at the same time. So, I'm going to drive over to the jungle island and drop this part off first. And, and this is one of those cases where, you know, I wish you could close the doors on the helicopter so you could safely transport them over, but there's there's also not that many big helicopters you can use. So it, it is just easier to use the uh, the ferry here. Though if I'm honest, I have this, this tendency to actually get myself stuck spinning in circles when I use the ferry. I'll just edit that part out though. But anyway, we're gonna drive off the ferry and we are going to bring these over to our scientist friend in the jungle. And man, this is, this is heavy and bulky. Great, a bin! This will make the shell of the rocket. <clears throat> All right, and then we will come back and grab the fuse. Oh, Flamingo, you're sleeping. It's been a hard, busy day. A fuse! Brilliant! 
now I can finish off the wiring. Uh, really? The lightning is, is, is a bit much, guys. All right. So now I'm going to grab Flamingo. And we're going to go get the uranium, which is the hardest part of this mission. And, um, you know what? I think I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get risky here. And I'm going to put Flamingo in the military helicopter. And we're going to fly up to the mine to start our... Oh, I forgot there are bombs in here. Let me put Flamingo down. Get rid of these bombs so we don't blow ourselves or Flamingo up. Get out of here. Get this one. Please don't get hit by lightning while I do this. All right. Goodbye. All right. So we are going to fly up to the mine. And, and let me tell you, Flamingo loves to fly. He, he absolutely is enjoying this. Am I, am I gonna clear, am I gonna clear that? Wait, no, 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 wait, wait, no. Flamingo, no, oh my gosh. I flew into a mountain. I have been playing this game for three years and yet I still just flew into a mountain. H how is it possible to be this bad at, at flying? And, and I mean, shouldn't Flamingo float? I, I mean, he shouldn't drown like I did. Wait, why? Am I not... Am I not dead? I didn't drown. Interesting. But I did lose Flamingo. Again. Alright, well, I, I think we've proven that this mission is too dangerous for Flamingo. So, he'll rejoin us at the end of the episode. But for now, let's go mine. And I do believe that uranium is more common since the update. But I'm going to I'm going to be honest, it it can still take a while. It 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 took until my 12th try for me to find uranium. I I had done this mission earlier on the PlayStation and it only took me 3 tries, but on the PC for some reason it took 12 tries. So yeah, it really is hit or miss, guys. So we're going to take the uranium out of the mine. We're going to come up to the guy and end the mission early. I mean, you could keep going and, and collect some more money. But as I said, it, it took me 12 tries to get here. So I already collected a lot of money earlier. All right. Get in the truck. So the last thing we need are barbells. And... Um, there are a few of them scattered around the island. I think some of the mansions actually have them inside. I think that's how my son got his done. There is also a set of barbells in the sewer that you get the flamingo. But the easiest one to get is by going to Paradise Island to the outdoor gym. And again, because I have this big piece of uranium in my truck. I'm going to switch over to one of the moving trucks because it won't fit. The barbell won't fit in here. So I'm just going to stop right here and grab this uh, furniture delivery truck right here. And then we drive around the corner and there is the wobbly gym. All right, so open the back of the truck and right inside here is barbells. All right. Ruh. I'm a strong wobbly. Okay, maybe not that strong. All right, so these got to go in the back of the truck, too. Get in there. All right. And now, now we have to drive back to the ferry and take it across the uh, bay here to the jungle island to give it to the scientist. All right, sir. Here are your barbells. You found some barbells! This metal will be perfect for the engines! And then we get the uranium, and we are finished! Uranium ore! This will help power the rocket! Alright. That's everything I need! Now I'll get to work. We'll be blasting off in no time! Come back tomorrow and I should have it ready okay that that's okay that gives us time to go get flamingo and come back all right it is the next morning and flamingo and I are back to check on our scientist friend 
Isn't it marvelous? Though perhaps a bit smaller than I was planning. I think we're ready to test it. How about you do it, as you did so much of the work? Give that button a press. Well, I love to press buttons. All right, Flamingo. Um, Flamingo, come on. Yeah, there we go. Woohoo! And you see, that right there is why it's taking so long to get the space update. Getting safely to space is hard. Incredible! That's the most excitement I've had in years. And I couldn't have done it without your help. I haven't forgotten your reward. I had some materials left over, so I've made a version of the rocket you can wear. I don't know if I want to. I thought you might find it fun. You have to wear all three parts of it at once for it to work, though. I'm pretty sure it'll work. Um, anyway, now I have to think about my next project. And we have unlocked the rocket outfit. So, you know what this means. It means our episode is coming to an end. I want to thank you guys for watching. And if you're enjoying Wobbly Life on the channel, please hit that like button to let us know. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so. It really helps us to grow the channel and you never miss an episode of Wobbly Life. All right, so Flamingo and I are going to try this out. All right, come over here. We've got some space around us. And begin our countdown. Three, two, one. Blast off! Whoa, 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 wait, 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 no! God, I've disintegrated Flamingo! This is horrible! Oh, the humanity! I don't, I don't think I like this game anymore. We'll be back soon with more videos. Thanks for watching.